You know, there's there's so many different layers to this movie. You know, there's like the very dramatic storyline that kind of goes on, and there's a little bit of a romance. There's a little bit of it that's funny, and then some challenging parts. I just can't let this go. Well, you're an artist, and artists feel things differently than regular people. I wanted one of the teachers to have a little bit of rock and roll, and, and I asked them if I could smash a cello, you know, after my thing, and they said, oh man, this is, that isn't really the movie we want to make. I said, well, give me an old cello that I can just kind of drop and show that he has disdain for his, his crowd, like the old flipping the bird like Nirvana used to do to their audience. But they still loved it, it's like, yeah, do it again. It wasn't so much of a challenge like the emotional scenes. I got pretty good at crying in front of 200 crew members, you know? It wasn't that tough. I kind of like took a deep breath and carried myself off to a place that wasn't so happy, you know? And it kind of just came and I had to cry a lot in the movie, so I got pretty used to it. But working with Rita was especially amazing. <gasps> I just got to know her as a person. What you see is what you get with Hillary, whether you know you're interviewing her or whether you get to know her, you know, she's just a really, really nice, kind person. To work with people like that makes the day go so much quicker. You know, it's fun. I really liked working with Oliver, he's really cute. And I fought for the accent to stay in the movie. And um, it was great. It was really cute, I think. I like you. I auditioned as an American and I was hired as an American. I don't know what it was, maybe it was the accent that, uh, that edged it. Yeah, that's, that's how it ended up. Well, like I said, I mean, she's just a very genuine, sweet girl. I think that's why the public relate to Hillary so much. She's that kind of girl next door, she's beautiful, and um, you know, you can't fault her, because she's just a good person. I kind of knew who she was, but I didn't, because I'm a little older, you know? But now I do, and I love her. I love Hillary Duff. I want to do another movie with her. <laughs> I learned for what I go once. I'd always sung. I read music because through singing lessons, you know, you'd sit down at the piano and pick out chords. So with what I go once, I learned the guitar. And then it was just a question of, you know, picking it up, familiarizing myself again, and just learning the songs that I had to play. You and me, can't you see how our hearts are one? Please believe and don't deceive. I mean, I trained as an actor. I'd love to do music. I think if it, it was the right situation, you know, if it, if it was right for me and it was the kind of stuff that inspired me, then great. But um, as it is, I think my focus is, is acting at the moment. We'll just see how that goes. I just gave you my E! True Hollywood story. You gotta give me something. I really liked watching this movie, actually, like when we went to the screening of it. Everything about it, you know, I thought it was really cute and the dramatic scenes, you know, I was very happy with. Sean did such a good job putting it together and working on it. It was a very quick shoot. And the scenery was so cool, you know, it really showed a lot of L.A. And I liked that Terry's such a strong believer in faith and I loved it. This song, Jay and I wrote together and um, I would like to dedicate it to my brother, Paul Fletcher. So we we'll won't give up. I think it's a lot more challenging than anything she's taken on before. To produce the goods like that just shows to juggle a music career and an acting career and still be producing good material is, uh, it speaks volumes for her. Raise Your Voice comes out, my album comes out on my birthday. Everything's busy right now. I'm a little tired. I'm sick right now, but um, I want to keep working if I can, you know? And if I can't, hopefully I'll be at peace with that too. celeb news make sure you subscribe to the e news youtube channel so you can stay informed on all the breaking updates come on you know you want to be the first to know about all the latest hookups breakups arrests and so much more